Australia has suffered more than 30,000 excess deaths since January 2021, as confirmed by the official Australian Bureau of Statistics. What has caused so many Australians to die? Let's take a deeper look into the data. Interestingly, in 2020, the year COVID struck the globe, Australia somehow reported 5,000 fewer deaths than average, even though 916 deaths were attributed to COVID-19. Into 2021, and Australia started to see an increase in mortality levels, with 2,775 excess deaths reported for the year, 1,448 of those attributed to COVID-19. The first doses of the COVID-19 vaccine were not available in Australia until the 22nd of February 2021. The first booster doses were rolled out on the 8th of November 2021. At this time, Australia appeared to be managing the COVID pandemic better than most countries across the world. By December 2021, over 21 million of Australia's 25 million population had been vaccinated. In 2022, however, Australia would go on to suffer horrendous levels of excess deaths. Over 20,000 extra deaths were reported in which equates to 12% above the baseline. 13,317 of those extra deaths were attributed to COVID-19. After containing the number of COVID-19 deaths in 2020 and 2021, Australia suffered a surge of extra deaths through 2022. 2023 also saw levels of excess deaths continue in Australia, with 8,744 more deaths than expected. This encoded for the new expected death baseline being increased by 3,000 on previous year's baseline. Something caused the extra death of 30,000 Australians during 2022 and 2023 that wasn't killing Australians in 2020 and 2021. Whilst the majority of the COVID deaths were contained in over 70s, excess deaths were seen across all age groups in 2022, including notable increases and mortality amongst the 0 to 34 and the 35 to 54 year olds, typically the most robust age groups in Australia. 2024 continues to see the trend of excess deaths. The latest figures from the Australian Bureau of Statistics show that the mortality rates to March this year were akin to those elevated levels of 2022 and 2023. The Australian government has ordered an inquiry into the cause of Australia's excess deaths since 2021. Questions need to be asked and answers need to be provided. The outcome of the inquiry will be of the interest to the entire world. All of the data provided in this video has been produced by official agencies and the Australian government itself. Links to all the data are provided within the video description. Thanks for watching.